But yeah, there must be a significant boss at the top of this place. There must be. You know what? I think I'm actually going to use one of those. Eight of them. Wait, it's item. This one's item discovery. Sorry. Not that. Might be worth it. Yeah, we'll head back to that voice soon, but for now. Ah, uh, I was trying to jump off the staircase. <laughs> of course, I, I popped the gold thing and then I'm going to die now. You know how it is. Ah, uh, too much. I'm going to die. One more and I can get him. Alright, worked out pretty well in the end. Out of FP though, although for now I think I'm happy to put one of these on. Easy FP gains to be made. Oh, let's go. Yeah, this place reminds me of the, a bit of the Rayo Lucaria Tower. Like, like the... Oh. Now, now, Freya. Don't let it boil you up. Take it slow. voice sounds so close, but I can't tell. Surely they're not one of the Red Knights, so... Oh, go away. Okay, how many more times? That combo is ridiculous. Oh. Literally did a 12 hit combo. Yeah, this one if you can't bully them with poise is very hard to to get around. Right, I'm quite far back now. Honestly, I think this one has to take a back seat for a little bit. I have to get uh, have to get this guy back. Just heavy load, of course.
I think also I'm using a lot of FP here, so I'm going to change my allocation a little bit. Guy again. Nice. Yeah, I need to go back up there. Continue to ignore stuff. Only problem is now that I've pulled the lever, what happens now? Thank you going this way. Not sure if this is the same path, it is the same path, yeah. There's too many of them now. Getting annoying. Yeah, the bullying weapon makes a big difference. Another one. Yeah, if they nail a back step, it gets a bit problematic. I have to regen stamina here. <sighs> yeah, the whole place is just infested with them. Right. afraid I'm busy. Oh, a curse upon my lack of foresight. I should have asked Ansbach to impart his knowledge when I had the chance. I'm afraid I'm busy. Truly. I should have asked Ansbach to impart his knowledge when I had the I'd rather not reset them all for, at this point. Um, let's keep trying to complete stuff. Right, now let's try this item. Right. right, we already did that. I 
things going here. How do we push forward? Maybe once you get this high, you pull the lever again. Another one oh here. Oh my lord. Would I ever make sense of this jumble? We are already up to 179,000 runes, which is good. I might just run in, get this item, and then leave again. Yeah, the crit only doing 800 damage is kind of lame. Oh wow, it came all the way up here. Really? That's dedication. Again, just running out of stamina. I have to be very careful with that, I really do. Okay, alright, we get it. Um, yeah, I mean, it needs another rotation. I need to find, like, another... Um, lever, I think. Now that I've taken out most of the threats, I should be fine. I'm just going to pull the other lever again and see what happens. Wow. Yeah, you can't pull it again. Fine. Do this. Whew, dangerous stuff. And these guys are going to start flinging flame at me, I can tell. Still on the move. Right. The ascent continues. As long as we're continuing to do that, then I can't really complain.
I love the way they close their books. It's just like, oh, for fuck's sake, all right. <laughs> oh, Lord. Will I ever make sense of this jumble? Mm. This one definitely looks a bit more end of the road. But there are still even higher bits to climb. I don't know if you can play it risky and jump there, or is that somewhere I've already been? No, it is. Definitely is. Because this bit isn't connected to the rest of it, so I'm like, how do I do the rest? God's sake, Do shut I up. Ever make sense of this jumble? Yeah, I'm not sure how to get to that section of it. Still think I'm missing something, but... See if we can take this guy out. If we can, there should be a level up on the cards. But it's one of the long sword ones, which I don't like. How did they have the range for that? And no, I didn't have. That's not fair. Regen some stand. Investment flame is just disgusting. Like once it gets a hit on you, that was like with a plus three flame drake thing. Basically, I wanted to cheese the entire fight originally, and I was like, you know what? I feel a little bit bad just doing that for the whole fight. <laughs> Let me get in and actually try and finish it off with some melee hits. And well, you saw what happened. Yeah, that attack, I can't... The swipes are so large that I can't get anything on those. So I literally just ran out of FP. But those guys are deadly. If they get, if you let them get any momentum on you, you're screwed. Yes, despite like this, it's like two or three swipes, you're dead. But here, just so I can properly spam my move. Alright, you get your first little pokey move. I tried to preempt it, I went too quick. Huh? What? Yeah, now I'm officially done. Alright, this next one should be a stagger.
How many? Oh my goodness. Yeah, preview for the fight against Mesmer. <laughs> Where like every attack is gonna kill me. Yeah, against the ones with a different what the ones that have like the smaller dagger type weapons, they're pretty easy to kill with this weapon. But when they have uh, the one with the longer sword, that's a different beast. At least by the time I'm done with this, I'll be able to actually get a full level up. <laughs> so yeah, now I'm officially not going to feel bad for choosing this enemy. When hit for hit there. This time it wasn't aggressive enough. I managed to get the win. Flame Spear. I mean, that move looked very powerful to me, so I kind of like that. Ooh. What have we got here? Aha! So, the climb continues. This area is basically the size of a DLC in and of itself. So I think we can level up both in terms of normal level and in terms of skater tree. No? Damn. Lame. And also no for that. Fine. So much for that. Still noticing my stamina run out a lot. Alright, let's open it up. Hmm. Yeah. We actually get a cutscene here. Oh man. Here we go. Big boss fight. Mongrel Intruder. That tarnished, it seemeth. Mother, wouldst thou truly lordship sanction in one so bereft of life? man himself. Yet, my purpose standeth unchanged. Those stripped of the grace of gold shall all meet death. I'm just wondering if I ran into him too soon. That's the only thing. I'm like, is this basically one of the final DLC fights?
He basically has a bolt of Grand Sex, like a fire version though. In the embrace of Mesmer's flame. Yeah, we might be hearing that one a few times. Now, the question here is, obviously... I mean, is this the right thing to do right now? Did I approach Mesmer too soon? Dude's literally like the cover of the DLC, so... That's the only thing I don't want to get into the whole, alright, let's go, like five hours of Mesmer fights only to be like, well, he was kind of the final boss of the DLC. Or like one of the two final bosses. Like, let's say I've got five major bosses to go. And after this one, there's only like one more. I don't know. It's a bit tough. I mean, it does point me towards here. Hmm. I'm not even sure. Let me try and speak to a couple of NPCs and stuff. I don't want to immediately launch into this. Uh, I don't think it's the best idea. Was it in here? I think it was in here, right? Yes. What could they possibly have in mind for Lord Moog's remains? The implicate. Oh. Well, what's this? Yes. Yes, I should have known. Even the truth was itself mere folly. As if using Lord Moog to gain entrance to the Land of Shadow were not enough, he plans to use his corpse as the vessel of his king consort. He has forsaken Lord Moog's soul. He desires only his empty shell. It beggars belief, but I'm afraid Tendermikola fails to grasp the humiliation implied by this act. One thing is certain. My dear lord deserved better. Righteous tarnished. You have my gratitude. You have given me the answers I needed, but I can hardly fathom it. Such folly unto the end. I am a warrior, but I've aged. I cannot afford to act hastily. Curse it all. I know my limits. I could spend the rest of my life honing my craft, and still that creature would be out of my blade's reach. The absolute folly of it all. Freya by the gods. She must be feeling the need to reaffirm her allegiance before she heads to war. A true red mane she is. Mm. Hardly troubled by the rot. <sighs> Righteous tarnished. Could you please give this to Freya? Thanks to you, she too will have the answer she requires. Yes. I can see her barreling into the fray right now. <laughs> There we go. So, Mikula basically seems like they used Mo to gain entry into the Land of Shadow. How? Like, as in how Mo was the, you know, the way that that happened, I don't know. But interesting stuff indeed. I'm afraid I'm busy. Truly. I should... From Sir Ansbach. To me, what on earth could it... Oh. Hmm. Hmm. Yes. Of course. I see. As the festival of war concluded, General Radan's soul met an honorable end, but kindly Mikola wishes to revive it, which is fine by me. I know it would pain old Jeren, but war has always suited General Radan best, and certainly far more than any honorable death. Endless war to invigorate the soul, as befits General Radan, the Great Lion. Yeah, so I guess um, this made me think of the re the way that you get into the DLC is, A, you have to beat Moog, that's the one everyone knew. But then there's the one I forgot, which is you have to beat Radan, who is also a sibling of Mikula, right? 
half sibling or something? Yeah, half sibling, I think. So, yeah. Thank you. Now I finally cast off my misgivings. Give my regards to Honorable Ansbach. Tell him, if we should meet in battle, to face your bow would be fine enough, but to face your blade would be an honor. Wow. All that remains is the fight for our kind Mikola. There we go. Interesting things happening, and Ansbach has disappeared. And so now we have big questions. <laughs>